Did you know that over 90% of the energy in nuclear fuel rods is still left when we dispose of them? That's a huge amount of untapped energy. Nuclear fuel rods are typically used for 3 to 6 years, and up to 96% of spent nuclear fuel can be recycled. So, why are only a few countries reusing nuclear waste? And why is France so good at it? About 5 hours from Paris lies the only nuclear recycling plant in the country, run by Orano. France has the highest share of nuclear power in the world, with about two-thirds of its electricity coming from nuclear plants. And all of the country's spent fuel is sent to Orano La Hague for recycling. But how exactly do you recycle spent fuel? Well, it starts with fuel removal. Fuel rods are carefully extracted using remote-controlled machinery inside sealed chambers. Once removed, the rods are transported to the next step, cooling. There, the rods are placed in cooling pools where they spend five to seven years until they cool down enough to be reprocessed further. And here's the amazing part. 96% of what's in those pools can be recycled, which means a lot of energy is saved. Next comes disassembly and separation. The metal cladding is removed from the fuel pellets, which are then placed in nitric acid to dissolve. Then a solvent is added to extract uranium and plutonium, leaving behind the fission products. Finally, a chemical is introduced to separate plutonium from uranium. The fission products, which make up about 4% of the waste, can't be recycled. But the recycled uranium is now ready to be used in regular nuclear power plants, replacing mined uranium. And that's not all. This process also produces purified plutonium. One gram of plutonium contains the energy equivalent of one metric ton of oil. While that sounds impressive, it's also the dangerous side of nuclear technology, because plutonium is a key ingredient in nuclear weapons. So, what does France do with the plutonium? Well, they handle it with extreme care. Orano transports the plutonium across the country in special trucks, escorted by the French military. It's then mixed with uranium to create MOX fuel, which can be used in standard nuclear reactors. This allows operators to use up to 30% less fresh uranium. So, why isn't every country recycling their spent fuel? The main reason is cost. The facilities and equipment needed for recycling are expensive. But as technology advances and nuclear energy continues to grow, hopefully more countries will adopt recycling in the future.